Hello everybody, today we make something that a lot of people request for this time we're gonna make it today. Today we make taralli with the fennel seeds. I wanna tell everybody, we still we do the video, but it's not the same quality. Can I, it's my wife, she taped me. And I wanna say to everybody, thank you very much. Now I got all the ingredients, I got the flour, white wine, oil, salt, and I got the fennel seeds over here. Now, for start of this, you gotta put on this cup over here, but so you got a machine, it's okay, you can use a machine and you mix everything together. Now, we start with the flour, and I put it right over here. At the flour, we can put the wine, And we put the oil. Okay, now we start the mix. And we see everything we got enough, the everything we got to do over here. Now I can put the salt. And the fennel seed, it got to go at the end. Now make sure this now, he gotta make us really good. He gotta do nice extra size. He gotta have a little muscle. Make us a mix. Very good. And now I put the final seeds. It give mix really good. The nugget, all the seeds he gotta go together with the taralli. Okay, now, this is to finish the mix. And I want to put it right on the board over here. Got this and now, you gotta mix really good. Now, you need a little muscle. Okay. This you gotta come really beautiful. Taralli, taralli di orsara. It should take all the fennel seeds. Like I say, you got a machine. You can mix with the machine, but I like it do by hand. Okay, this almost done. It look a nice look now. You roll it like this. Okay. Now we gotta make the taralli. In the taralli we start cora the piece like that. You put the dough right over here and you cover, in okay, case stay a little damp. This, uh, you know, using no flour. This, that's uh, all what you gotta do like this. And you roll, and you roll like that. You can make a little thick as so you want, but so you want, you can make it thin. Okay, see, when you do like this, it's easy. Like this, you take, and you do like that, you pinch, and you cut it. You turn, you pinch, and you cut it. You cut it like this, and you cut it. And after you put everything on the side. Okay, now this it's all done, but make sure when you do pinch this really good, the guy you don't want to open up. Okay, the water boil, make sure the water the boil. And we start to put inside, one by one, not put all together. Put like maybe seven or eight, it's a bigger parts, so you can put them more. Okay, we do on two time. All right, now you take this and make sure that the touch a little bit, the inner stick on the pads, like that. See coming up one or two, you take out and you put on the towel. 
okay? It, you know, it dry a little bit. After that, we put on the fats of the gonion. Maybe take like uh, one and a half, about two minutes, they're coming up. Okay, now, see, it starts the coming up, when it's coming up, you gotta take it out. And you put it right on the paper, on the top over here, like this. One time I take out everything this. We start to put this other one. At the time, this you got coming up, you come on this side over here and you start to make, okay, you no got to stay too close. Cause this is thick after you see the, the water. Phew, it's so hot. Okay, and now we wait for the rest. Okay, now I was a boy all thing. Now we started to put this, everything over here like that. And this, you gotta go in the oven for 400 degrees for 40 minutes. Okay, look at a beautiful look. I hope it fits everything over here, or one part. It's so easy to make this dish. It's no hard. Maybe you got the kids at home. It can help you to do this together. Okay, and now let's go. And we put it right in the oven. Okay, 40 minutes and this will be done. Okay, now it's 40 minutes and let's see my taralli. Look a beautiful look. Nice, nice color. Let's close the oven. Now it's really, look at that. Look a beautiful, huh? Nice color. But now this, ooh, ooh. It's really hot, I take one. Ooh, so hot. This, it's good that we was make this for Christmas and we was make this for East. Now it's a good time to make for East. It look nice, nice crisp inside. It got a lot of fennel seeds you can see over here. Nice crunchy, and the seeds of the fennel is smell so good. It's a nice cook. Okay, you gotta cook really good this inside. Okay, when you eat this, you can put inside the wine, you dip, and you eat. Really good. I want to say thank you very much, and I hope everybody make this. Thank you, and we'll see you next time. Thank you.